after ignoring 20 non-compliance orders from the Human Rights Tribunal and spending $10 million fighting First Nation kids in court, this government has a new scheme. They're simply ignoring their obligation to pay the therapists who are providing the First Nation children services under Jordan's principle. The minister's policies are in direct defiance of the Rights Tribunal ruling, and this is threatening to put child therapists into bankruptcy. We're talking about the most fragile children in the country. Why is this government so determined to deny First Nation children access to Jordan's principle services for which they are entitled? The Honourable Minister for Indigenous Services. Mr. Speaker, since July 1st, 2016, the federal government has approved an estimated 2.56 million products under Jordan's principle, Mr. Speaker. That means that Indigenous children are getting the health services they need all across the country. And Mr. Speaker, as the member opposite knows, I'm looking into this particular case. We'll ensure that providers who provide services can get paid in, a, in, a, in an acceptable time frame to continue to deliver those services.